Sometimes you get these cabinets and the scratch and dent. Huge discount when this happens, but it's a lot of work to repair it. It's in a totally wrong shape right now. Remove the door. Now we'll be able to see the damage. This piece just flew right off. We'll collect all these little pieces. Like a puzzle, they'll go back in. This piece will need to go in and up. We'll grab a clamp and apply a bit of pressure to see where it goes. We'll give some light taps with a plastic hammer. This broken piece is stopping it from Use going a chisel in. chisel to guide it back we'll in. Push at that 45 degree angle to I get it pressure in. on here. You can see it's starting we'll to offset a clamp to kind of pull it in. It's lined up in this direction. We'll pull it down. With downward pressure, we'll pull this clamp. Now it looks like it's coming into alignment. With another clamp, we'll pull it in. We'll fight one clamp onto another. Looking better. We'll snug it back in from the side. Now it's back into alignment. There's tension coming from this inside plate. A lot of tension will remove this little piece here. Now we can clearly see where this goes. Some of these staples that are holding the tension. Pull this back, we can see a staple in there and really in the way. We can clearly see the staple. Work on getting this staple out. Work everything back and forth till it comes out. Now we've got both staples With out. With pressure released, I can almost push this in by hand. C-clamp on this board and raise this up. Now we're level here. Clamp another C-clamp to the wood. With the tension off, we can start to piece in the wood pieces. One piece at a time like a puzzle. Place in that top part. We pull things apart a little bit and place in some glue. Put glue on all the parts. At least now we know it'll all go back together without tension. We'll put tension on the clamps. Just watch for everything lining up. We'll put the side tension on. Place in all the little pieces. There'll be some glue on the surface but we'll sand that off at the end. Just clamp these pieces in tight. It might be dirty but just make sure it fits. Just keep pulling everything in. This is fitting really nice here at the top. Like a little puzzle all put back together. We'll let this dry overnight. With everything dry we can take the clamps off. It's the right shape, but it's rough. We'll block sand it with 80 grit. Still see the wood pieces, but it's looking a lot better. Now we can put everything back together.